Okay guys, so I'm here previewing Manny Pacquiao vs. Brandon Wheels. Now the key to victory for Brandon Wheels are basically to get up close and personal with Manny Pacquiao and use his body to bully Manny Pacquiao to the corner because Brendan Wheels is two inches taller and his body frame is a little bit wider and considering that I think that Pacquiao won't back down he could possibly bully Manny Pacquiao around if they get within close quarters. Now, once they get within close quarters, then a lot of that left hook to the body that wheels likes to grow. And combine that with a right and left uppercut that wheels also like to go in close range. If this fight is contested at long range, Rios has no shot because Manny is quicker both with his hands and with his feet so Manny can get out of the way. Now, for Manny, a lot of people can get he may knock out Brandon Wheels, but that's not a, sm a smart game plan, in my opinion. What I consider a smart game plan for Manny in this fight is basically to stay as far away from Brendan Wheels and use his speed and quickness to get in and out. Constantly throw out the, the straight left and follow that with the power rate. But never get within close quarters of Brendan Wheels because like I said, he has the bigger body frame and his color and might be able to bully Pacquiao. So Pacquiao wants to keep distance between those fighters and maybe go to gap along with the straight left and the straight right. Ultimately, I believe Brandon Wheels is going to win this fight because Manny Pacquiao is going to want to prove a point. He's going to want to knock out Brandon Wheels, which means this fight will most likely be within close quarters. And that's bad news for Pacquiao. Because I expect Brendan Wheels to use the left hook to the body and to use the uppercut to penetrate Pacquiao's head. So that's it for right now, guys. Peace. And I do expect Brendan Wheels to win.